Okay, I'm going to be talking to you about how we can add and subtract mixed number fractions. So first of all, we can see that this is a mixed number fraction because it's a mixture of a whole number and a fraction at the side of it here. So first thing that we need to do is make this into an improper fraction where it has a bigger numerator than a denominator. In order to do that, we need to multiply the whole number by the denominator because this is equivalent to six lots of six as a whole number. So one times six is six. Add the two gives us eight. So now this becomes eight, six. Okay, then we can add three, six to it because it doesn't need to change. And they're both the same denominator. So we just add the numerators, numerators together. Eight add three is 11. And then we keep the denominator the same. This turns into 11, six. And then this is still an improper fraction. So we can create a mixed number fraction by seeing how many six go into 11, which is one with five left over. So it's five sixths left over. So our answer when we've finished is one and five sixths. Now we're gonna subtract a mixed number fraction with a fraction. Okay, so here we've got two and three fifths. So again, multiply the whole number two by five, which will give us 10, add the three, and we are 13 fifths, and we've created an improper fraction. We then want to subtract it by four tenths, but we've got an issue. Both denominators are different. We've got fifths and we've got tenths. Now, first of all, I'm gonna look and see, can I make this into fifths? Yes, I can divide this by two, and whatever I do to the bottom, I do to the top. Can I divide that by two? Yes, I can. So that gives us two fifths. Now we can do a simple subtraction because we've got the same denominator. So 13 take away two gives us 11. And we keep the denominator the same, 11 fifths. Again, we've got an improper fraction. Let's make that into a mixed number fraction. See how many fives go into 11, which is two. And we are left with one fifth left over. So the answer would be two and one 